If you have an iPhone, like you're probably using the Messages app, which includes the iMessage service for free messaging between Apple devices. But what many people don't realize is that there are settings inside the app that can open a big door to spying or leaking your personal data without you noticing. Let's go through each setting together, what it does and why you need to turn it off immediately. One, share name and photo automatically. This setting allows your name and photo to appear automatically when you message someone. Like the problem is that you might be messaging an unknown number or someone not saved in your contacts. And in that case, the app can share your photo and name automatically without asking each time. As a result, someone could take your photo or use your data to impersonate you or create a fake account. Solution, go to settings, apps messages, Share name and photo. Set it to always ask. From now on, every time you message a new person for the first time, iMessage will ask, do you want to share your name and photo with this person? You'll be able to choose yes or no yourself, giving you full control with nothing shared without your permission. Two, in show message content in notifications. By default, when you receive a message, part of it appears on your lock screen. It might look harmless, but it's very risky if someone picks up your phone or glances at the screen by accident. That's a clear privacy violation, especially in public or at work. Solution, go to settings. Notifications. Messages. Show previews. Choose when unlocked or never. That way, message content won't appear unless you unlock your phone yourself. Three, devices connected to your account. iMessage can work across multiple devices, iPhone, iPad, Mac, but sometimes we forget about old devices or ones that someone else used with our Apple ID. Any device connected to your account can read all your messages easily, even without you knowing. Solution, go to settings. Your name, Apple ID. Scroll down until you see devices. Check the list. If you find a device you don't use or don't remember, tap it and choose remove from account. You can also check from settings, apps, messages. send and receive. Review the email addresses or phone numbers connected to iMessage and remove anything unfamiliar. Four, shared with you, automatic content sharing. This feature automatically shows photos or links sent to you in other apps like Photos or Safari. It looks convenient on the surface, but it's a big privacy risk underneath. Your data might be shared between apps without your explicit consent, reducing your control over privacy. Also, anyone with access to your device could see content you never intended to show. Solution, go to settings, messages, shared with you. Turn it off or manually select which apps are allowed to share content. Five, important addition, read receipts. The read receipts feature 
lets others know when you've read their messages and at what time. It's not a direct security threat, but it's definitely a privacy concern. It can cause awkward or tense situations, especially if you've seen a message but haven't replied yet. Solution. Go to Settings Messages Send read receipts. Turn it off. That way, no one knows you've read their message unless you respond. Finally, iMessage privacy is strong by default, but only if you take control of these settings yourself. Adjust them now to stay 100% safe. See you in the next video.